Hello, I'm Jonathan, and I'm here with my colleague Patty, and we're going to look at this uh, periodic table of videos in the chemistry department um, that's covered with little tiny computer codes called QR codes. So each one of these little codes goes to an element on the periodic table of the elements. So we're going to start up here with this first one, and I'm going to take my phone, and I'm going to launch the Google app. And the Google search app is going to take a picture. I'm going to use that to take the picture of this QR code. So I'm going to take a picture, line it up, make sure it's in focus, and then I'm going to press. Now it's going to go search for this. So it's searching and searching, and it came back very quickly with a link to a video down at the bottom here. So if I tap on that, it'll take me right to the video. And I'm going to press play. So um, we're braving the elements, Brady, to repeat the experiment that we did quite some time ago. So you'll remember we had a very small balloon of hydrogen. Match on a stick to hydrogen. Big bang coming. You ready? Yep. Here we go. And the fact that we've come outside might actually give you an idea about what we're going to do, because we're going to make it a little bit bigger. So let's go and fill a balloon. All right, cool. Well, hydrogen, I think, is very important because it's the simplest atom. It's the atom consists of a positively charged proton, which is relatively large, and a negatively charged electron that goes round it. So there you have it. That was hydrogen, the QR code for hydrogen on the periodic table of videos. Thank you.